short review of the Wielanti Mini LED Projector. It's a portable projector that's marketed as the most cost-effective high-resolution LED projector. And uh, in this review, we might find out that it actually may deliver on that claim. So here's what comes in the box. You get the projector itself, a 12-volt, 2-amp power uh, adapter, uh, audio-video cables out to another source, a remote control, and a user guide. Now the projector itself is quite small, meaning it's very portable. Uh, and what you get on the projector is actually quite a lot. Uh, so at the top of the projector you've got uh, the power button, you've got some navigation buttons, you've got a, um, an OK or enter kind of button, a return, also kind of an enter button, a source select, input select. On the back of the projector you'll see here you've got a slot for a micro SD card. You've got a, uh, a five volt uh, charging port, headphones out, audio video out. On this side, you've got the, the regular DC power in. You've got an on off switch to shut the entire projector completely off. Uh, you've got a, um, a, uh, a, an HDMI port and a USB 2.0 port. On the other side, uh, that's where you've got your focus. So you've got a little lever here to focus the camera and you'll see the, uh, the lens coming in and out. And on the bottom you've even got a, um, a tripod mount. Uh, so you can mount it on a tripod, uh, project you know movies, pictures, images. Um, so it's super portable. Uh, throw it in a small backpack and you're off. On the remote uh, you've got the standard buttons. You've got a power button, uh, you've got a mute button, Rewind, fast forward, pause and play, some navigations and OK. Uh, you've got the return, you've got a menu button, input source, and a plus and minus button. Pretty simple remote, takes a couple of little batteries, and that's about it. So here's the projection from the projector on the wall of my office at home. Uh, you can see it's a pretty good size. It's about uh, three by five, I'd say. Uh, this is typically where I'd have a six-foot sofa. I just moved it out of the way so I can have some room to project. This is the main menu that you get when you turn on the projector. And you'll see you have the option of movie, music, photo, or text. And by using the input button on the projector, uh, you'll be able to get the input, toggle through the input. Now, USB is simply for sticking a USB stick in or... Um, you know, uh, you know, hooking up to a computer or something like that and showing files, text files, uh, pictures, images, those kinds of things. SD card obviously is for images. Uh, AV is for uh, connecting to audio video uh, cables. HDMI. With an HDMI you'll need to, uh, to have a, uh, uh, an adapter. Um, I've got it hooked up to an iPhone here and you'll see that I'm able to project the entire iPhone display onto the wall. And if we just show here, we'll bring up a quick video. So there you have it, the mini LED projector. It projects at a resolution of about 1920 by 1080 maximum. Um, and on the wall, about three feet by five feet, depending upon how far back you, uh, you, you, know, you set the projector. Again, very portable easily thrown into a, to a backpack. You will need a, um, you know, a, uh, an HDMI adapter and an HDMI cord if you want to project from an iPhone, an iPad, some kind of tablet. Uh, the, uh, the Chromecast works fantastic on it. I, I, I tried that out. USB stick, um, SD card in the back. Um, be, you know, be assured that this is not a professional AV component, but for $50 to $75 on Amazon or some other, you know, uh, site, it's a great little option for having a lot of fun, just kind of showing uh, images, quick movies, videos from, you know, a mobile device, uh, having fun with your friends or family. Uh, so that's it. Thanks a lot, guys.